This is Matt Kaiser with CBS Sports. Today, we are able to interview Nasty Deke, Wake Forest basketball superfan and dancing phenomenon. Nasty Deke is a fun-loving, overweight dancing machine who tries to get people really pumped up at any Wake Forest event. Yeah, as a student, I was always into everything. I mean, any kind of athletics, I was always into. Um, I was there when we started the uh, Screaming Demons, and I was one of the first members of the Screaming Demons. I do it just to make sure people get into it, because, you know, sometimes, back in the day, Wake Forest didn't always have a great reputation for just really crazy fans, and, um, you know, I, I kind of do it to make sure everybody else gets into the game, you know. So um, as long as people are enjoying it, I'm going to continue to do it. Uh, my favorite part about being Naz T. Deke is uh, usually the kids that come up to me either at a game or even like in town somewhere um, outside of Wake Forest. Uh, people will recognize me and the kids especially will come up and they'll actually ask me for an autograph or, you know, ask me to pose for a picture with them, that kind of thing. And it's just, it just blows me away that they actually want me to do that. The difference between Naz T and me as a person uh, really isn't too much, actually, because, um, you know, I'm, I'm all about Wake Forest. I love Wake Forest. I think we've got the best university anywhere. Skip Prosser, when he was the coach here, he really started a resurgence in the fan experience and people really getting into the games. And that's really when I started doing the dancing thing at the game. Um, Skip Prosser came to me one time and said, listen, I just want you to know I really appreciate the sacrifice you're making for the program because I know doing what you're doing, you're never going to get a date. <laughs> it's not true, Skip. I know Chris Paul pretty well um, from, and talk to him from time to time. And uh, he told me a funny story one time about uh, when I was doing my thing during a timeout and it was during a heated part of the game. And Chris was over on the bench and he kind of glanced over to see what I was doing in terms of you know, what dance moves I was pulling out. And uh, the coaches jumped on him and said, you pay attention to what we're doing in here, not to what's going on out there. You know, I was, I'm really fortunate. Um, I had a great relationship with Skip Prosser when he was here. Um, had a fantastic relationship with Dino Gaudio. Uh, Dino stepped in and did a very, very admirable job um, when Skip Prosser passed away. And I couldn't thank Dino enough for what he did in terms of uh, carrying on not only Skip's legacy, but the success of Wake Forest basketball. Uh, you know, from time to time, I'll bring in maybe a little special guest to come dance with me. Um, and it's kind of a surprise to the crowd. And everybody loves it because it's usually somebody that they recognize from the past. Um, a couple of people that I have yet to get out there, you know, I really want to get Muggsy Bogues out there <laughs> dancing with me. I mean, that's my goal. So if Muggsy's watching this, please, you got to dance with me, Muggsy. Um, Alfonso Smith one of the greatest defensive backs in ACC history that played football for us. Yeah. Um, when he graduated, he actually contacted me and said, hey, now that I've graduated, I don't have to worry about what the coaches say. I want to dance with you at a basketball game. Kenny Moore, who's playing wide receiver for the Carolina Panthers, he also got out there and danced with me a little bit. Actually, um, we didn't even have to rehearse the moves. I basically met them before the game and said, hey, these are the basic moves, okay? You got you know, this move, this move, and this move. Just follow me and just go with it. All right, here we go. So we're getting ready. We're jumping around. We're jumping around, getting everybody into the game. Woo, here we go. Everybody, come on. And then we do a little, we do a little snake. We do a snake. We're doing a snake. We come around, and then we ride the pony. We're riding the pony. Pack it in. Let me begin. I came knowing that on me. That's a sin. I won't live a sack of punky better back up. Try and play the role and you're the whole crew will act up. Get up, stand up, come on, your hands up. If you got the feeling, jump across the ceiling. Once there's a bump flop, someone's fucking jump. Yeah, I'll bust them in the eye, and then I'll take the pump out. Feeling funky, amps in the trunk, and I got more rhymes than this cop's at a junkie. Don't let shot, show enough, I got. 
This is Matt Kaiser with CBS Sports.